Who Moved My Cheese by Spencer Johnson. Sniff sniffs out change early. Scurry scurries into action. Him denies and resists change as he fears it will lead to something worse. Hall learns to adapt in time when he sees changing leads to something better. While in the past we may have wanted loyal employees, today we need flexible people who are not possessive about the way things are done around here. Having cheese makes you happy. The mice did not overanalyze things. They were not burdened with complex beliefs. The more important your cheese is to you, the more you want to hold on to it. Maybe we should stop analyzing the situation so much and get going and find some new cheese. They didn't find any for some time until they finally went into an area of the maze where they had never been before. Doing the same thing over and over won't make things better. Sometimes when things change, they are never the same again. If you do not change, you can become extinct. What would you do if you weren't afraid? When you are afraid things are going to get worse if you don't do something, it can prompt you into action. But it is not good when you are so afraid that it keeps you from doing anything. Adapting to change sooner makes things easier. Better late than never. Smell the cheese often so you know when it's getting old. Movement in a new direction helps you find new cheese. When you stop being afraid, you feel good. Imagining yourself enjoying your new cheese leads you to it. The quicker you let go of old cheese, the sooner you will find new cheese. It is safer to search in the maze than remain in a cheeseless station. What you are afraid of is never as bad as what you imagine. When you change what you believe, you change what you do. You can believe that change will harm you and resist it, or you can believe that finding new cheese will help you to embrace the change. It all depends on what you choose to believe. Noticing small changes early helps you to adapt to the bigger changes that are to come. The fastest way to change is to laugh at your own folly. Then you can let go and quickly move on. You do not need to overcomplicate matters or confuse yourself with fearful beliefs. The biggest inhibitor to change lies within yourself and nothing gets better until you change. Some fears should be respected as it can keep you out of real danger but most fears are rational and keeps you from changing when you need to. Change happens. They keep moving the cheese. Anticipate change. Get ready for the cheese to move. Monitor change. Smell the cheese often so you know when it's getting old. Adapt to change quickly. The quicker you let go of old cheese, the sooner you can enjoy new cheese. Change. Move with the cheese. Enjoy change. Savor the adventure and enjoy the taste of new cheese. Be ready to change quickly and enjoy it again and again. They keep moving the cheese. What would you do if you weren't afraid? What do you need to let go of and what do you need to move on to? Let go of old behavior, move on to a better way of thinking and acting.